federal government has launched an investigation into Delta Airlines and how it handled the tech meltdown. Delta has been struggling to recover since that crowd strike outage grounded thousands of flights around the world last Friday. A Delta has canceled thousands of flights and is now in its fifth day of problems. Well, Fox News' Christopher King is live at Hartsfield Jackson tonight. Christopher, Delta has canceled hundreds of flights again today, right? Ross Courtney, that is so frustratingly true for so many passengers. Still, lots of travelers here at Hartsfield Jackson. Some had to go home and come back. Some had to sleep in airports. All of them Delta passengers, but you do have rights. It makes you feel pretty, pretty upset. Chris Hart and his wife had big plans this week. We were supposed to go on a cruise and out of Seattle. But when they got to Hartsfield Jackson on Sunday, Delta delayed their flight. About uh, three hours. Then the news they didn't want to hear. And they got canceled completely. It completely uh, destroyed our cruise plans. No cruise for you? No cruise, and we lost all the money off of it, too. Hart was out $1,000. Shock. Can't believe that uh, something like this could actually happen. Delta still struggling from the CrowdStrike tech outage that hit Microsoft users around the globe last Friday. Companies have largely recovered. Still on Tuesday, airlines delayed or canceled thousands of flights nationwide. It just put the monkey in the wrench. Delta facing the biggest backlog. The airline on Tuesday canceled hundreds of flights around the country and delayed more than a thousand. The airline says it's working around the clock to return operations to normal by the end of the week. It is extremely frustrating. Veronica Rogers and her family flew from Tokyo to Minneapolis on Sunday. The flight from Minneapolis to here was canceled. We all slept there overnight. Her son and husband on Tuesday still stuck in Minneapolis. Rogers says the airline offered her family no compensation. There was no no vouchers, no nothing. We're going to get an E credit for uh, uh, for our flight. Now, the U.S. Department of Transportation launched an investigation into the carrier's response. Delta says it is cooperating. Now, remember, you do have rights. The DOT says you may be entitled to a refund if an airline cancels or significantly delays your flight. We'll have a link to the agency's page and a link to Delta's page to request a refund on our website. We're live at Hartsfield Jackson. Christopher King. Fox 5 News. Mm, yeah, the frustration continues for so many. Christopher, thanks.